The table above lists the lengths to the nearest inch of a random sample of 21 brown bullhead fish. All right, so someone measured a bunch of fish. Uh, they got like eight, nine, 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 blah, 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 16, and then somebody got a 24. Look at you. Uh, the outlier measurement is 24. Oh, and it's an error. Figures. Of the mean, median, and range of the values listed, which will change the most if the 24-inch measurement is removed from the data. Well, if I remove, uh, first off, the median will not change. Okay, the median is the guy in the middle. So the guy in the middle of this entire chart is a 12 and a group of 12s. That won't change. The mean will change. But if you're thinking, all of a sudden I have this big fish amongst 20 other fish, the mean will go down if I remove uh, 24 slightly. So the mean will change. But we're talking about a difference of eight inches here, eight inches over 21. You're talking about the mean changing less than an inch. However, if I change the range, which is the biggest number minus the smallest number, I right now have 24 minus eight, which means my range is 16. If I remove the 24, that range is now cut in half. It's a change of eight. So my range is absolutely 100% going to be the things that thing that changes the most. Okay, when you have an outlier, the median should not change or it won't change that much. If you have an outlier, the mean will change but an outlier changes the range the most in pretty much any circumstance, no matter what, hands down.